Morning and welcome to the vlog. It's not windy today, which is choice for a change. Unfortunately, it's just starting to rain. That, that's cool though, because I'm going to go out and find somewhere inside and do some stuff today. today come down to power station which is this old abandoned coal-fired power station and the sheer scale of these buildings in here is insane it's so creepy and it's been abandoned for years and vandalized but I wanted to check it out and see if I could do a skate video in here at some time it's so cool man but it's so creepy I just walked through this part and there's this hallway with all these pitch black dark rooms off to the side and it's like I don't know what's going on so yeah I'm out here because it's um it's light and open but let's keep looking around what it did anything like obviously it was a power station so I'm guessing the big chimneys were for fires and whatnot and I would say down here would have had like generation stuff but I just honestly have no idea and there's all these massive concrete things with frames I'm just trying to find some way to get upstairs and have a quick look up there Land. I wish I'd charge my Fitbit because my heart is fucking racing at the moment. I don't know how high I walk up these stairs, but they go a long way. Seeing things like that kind of creeps me out a little bit because it's obviously like the concrete's just fallen. So I don't think I'll be up here too long. Doesn't look like there's a lot to see up here, just more graffiti and vandalism. And just this huge fucking room. The scale of this is just amazing. Sorry if I'm a bit quiet too, it's like, it's creepy. You feel like you're trespassing. Feels like you shouldn't be here. Which is technically true, but it is what it is. I'm guessing this used to be an elevator shaft so we'll stay away from that one because that's probably dodgy. guessing we're in some form of like control room or admin block there's a bigger sort of admin -y looking people area down the other end so I'm guessing that's like the main admin but I think this is like control room or something or maybe I don't know lunch room something like that anyway but it's pretty cool big and creepy ass. Charge engine. 
So I'm guessing that's charge engineer. So yeah, like people who were running the plant or whatever must have been in this building, I think. Still pretty cool. Though. I think I'll go through here too much because there's been a fire through here. There was a fire through here a couple of years ago and that shit makes chemicals and yuckiness. So yeah, I think I'll just have a quick look around and get out of here. Plus it's creepy as hell and dark. The graffiti is amazing though. Like the artistic quality of some of this graffiti is just unreal. So yeah, I think to me, that's enough of a sign that I'm kind of done exploring. <laughs> it's time to get back to the car. So that was a pretty cool way to spend the day. I've just been sitting here chucking together the video from today and I've got through the first bit and I'm getting into the second part of today and it's too much, it's too much. It doesn't really fit in with this morning's video and it's separate tonight. And I've already kind of reached the length that I try and keep all my videos at. So I'm gonna do like a part two tomorrow, which will include this afternoon's adventure. I hope that's okay with you, but today was pretty cool. That was, oh, it was so great getting out of the house and going on that epic adventure and checking out that mad abandoned place. I love doing stuff like that. And in the last month, I've been so trapped here and trapped at home. Leaving the house hasn't even been an option. Like it's something I wanna do, but I haven't been able to do it. Today, man, I got out of the house. I went on this massive adventure. I left at like nine o'clock this morning and I got back about six o'clock tonight. It's just been so good to be out of the house and living again. And I'm really starting to feel like myself again and really starting to find that happiness and that inner peace inside me, which I haven't felt for such a long time. And it is so, so damn good. I wanna say thank you to everyone that's stuck by me going through this rough patch recently. Like I am expert at pushing everyone away when I'm hurting. And I've done a good job of that and I've pushed a lot of people away, but there's been a few core people that have stuck with me. And I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart because you guys are the ones that have got me through this. And also there's been a few new people come into my life and man, it's just, it's amazing when you connect with all this positive energy around you, just how much that changes your own internal energy. I'm feeling so good and so happy right now it's just amazing so just thank you thank you so much anyway that's enough dribbling for now i'm going to finish up editing editing and i will catch you on the next one thanks for watching i love you see you next time bye Don't wait me.